the Hoosier Dome, the TV46 3A Championship, brought to you in part by the good folks at National Recreation Systems for the best seat in the house. Ron Colley on the move, ball at the 19-yard line. First down and 10, Carver the quarterback. Back to his big back, Mike Bone. He picks up where he left off, and Bone gobbles up the yards close to another first down. They had a number of them in the first half. Eight of them to be precise, a pickup of eight yards, well, nine yards on first down. It'll be out to the 28-yard line, and again, Bone not afraid. Watch him now. He gets to the outside. He's got plenty of room on the outside, but he, he'll cut it right back in between two defenders, try to split him right there, and Stickley able to hang on. Again, Bone not that big, 5'11", 180. Good speed, though. Certainly gets the yards. After uh, getting the initial contact as well, he's a tough, tough competitor. And down there, but not before, a first down for the Rebels. Gain of seven yards on the play. 194 on the night for Mike Bone. Bone running for Ron Colley, the school with 746 students here in 3A. The thing that makes it so tough for Ron Colley is that they don't fumble the ball. They just don't make mistakes very often. Bowen especially protects that football. First down and 10. A little misdirection there on the handoff to Jaffe. And we've got a penalty flag here. It looks like it might be holding against Ron Colley. They're pointing to the center, Andy Roel. Personal foul kicking. So Andy Royal going to be called on the penalty. It was a gain of one yard on the play, and they will walk it back now inside the 30, inside the 20 to well, mm. about right around the 21 yard line. Wow. I don't know if we'd have a chance to see that there or not, but uh, penalty. Foul kicking. 15 yard. On the offensive it's team, it's 30 still yards first and penalties down. tonight for Ron Kelly. Northwood, 25 yards on two penalties. Watch number 50 in here, see if we can see the kick. With number 50, I didn't see it. First down, 24 yards to go from the 21 yard line. High backfield, the pitch is to Bone. Bone dropped against Stickley in on the play. This area is wholesale manufacturer of Highline recreational vehicles, fifth wheels and travel trailers is Travel Supreme. With over 50 dealerships throughout the country and Europe, Travel Supreme has distinguished itself as an industry leader, building extended living vehicles complete with all amenities. Just like the Panthers, Travel Supreme is committed to excellence. Glenn Troyer and Paul Miller stand behind the Travel Supreme product and are standing behind the Panthers this year in their quest of the state championship. Much success to the entire team from Travel Supreme. State Road 19, Wakarusa. Carver, the quarterback, on the pitch to Bone. Bone gets a nice block. It's another block. And Bone gobbles up a lot of those yards that were assessed against the Ron Colley Rebels on the infraction. Gain of nine more for Bone. But in that particular situation, Northwood able to play a little prevent here. See a good effort to turn the play in by Ryan Hattery. And then Hartman comes up and makes a stop along with Schaefer. Third down and 11. Best chance so far as uh, Bone goes over the 200 yard mark on the night. 207 on 27 carries. Bone gets the call and Northwood comes up with a big defensive play. Gain Superb of, job out there by the Panthers. Gain of four yards on the play for Bone. But a nice job. And again, Northwood just has to play a little prevent here. They don't have to stop at the line of scrimmage. Good, good depth. Reinhardt had an arm on him for a second, slowed him up just enough. Stickley and company came in and stuck him. Yep. And now the Northwood Panthers need a return here. Need good field position, need to get on the board. 5-14 to go third quarter, plenty of time. Nate King, Bob, also in on the play on the stop. And there's a fine punt down to the 18-yard line. Here comes Nate Andrews. Andrews dropped at the 24-yard line, and a flag on the play. That might have been a late hit. 
Seattle will check it out with exactly five minutes remaining in the third quarter of play. As Northwood fans need something to cheer about. Panthers, defensively, Bob, have not allowed any points in the third quarter of this season. 15 yards from the end of the run. 37 yard punt, down. five yard return, 15 yard penalty on the face mask. And it'll be marked off from the 23, so out to the 38 yard line come the Northwood Panthers. And that's a uh, mark it out to 39. It's all right with us. Three major penalties in the ballgame tonight for Ron Kelly. This is the quarter. Traditionally, you'll see the Panthers come to life. They need a good series of plays here on first down and 10 from a 39. Andrews fakes it to the line, keeps it himself, far sideline, running room, great speed. Andrews popped out of bounds. They're going to call it back, though, at the 42-yard line. A big play, though, by Trevor Andrews. This is going to say he stepped out just inside the 43. Watch Andrews, and this is what we were talking about early in the first half. You just got to go ahead and throw your fastball here. You'll see him step right there on the out-of-bounds stripe. Took a good lick down the field, but it's a first down and a nice uh, way to start a drive. Pick up on the play of 18 yards. And another first down. Northwood's trying to get a crank. Keep in mind, Ron Cowley has not given up a point all year in the third quarter. Got to give up some here. Here comes Andrews. It's Nate Andrews down to the 21-yard line. That's the combination we talked about in the pregame. Nate and Trevor. Trevor with the first down. Now Nate Andrews comes back with a great run here, getting the pitch from his brother. Gain on the play of 22 yards. Good play fake that time by Trevor Andrews. You see what we mean? He becomes a lightning rod, and then the defenses go to him, and you can pitch the ball and pick up big yardage. Callender and Reinhardt wide right on first down and 10 from the 21 yard line. Nate Andrews across the 20 to near the 17 yard line. Mark it uh, inside the 17. Pick up the four, call it four yards on the play. Well, with the absence of newcomer now injured on the sideline, Nate Andrews taking over and showing why he will be one of the top backs throughout the area next year. Got some pretty fresh legs out there right now. Bunch and Andrews in the backfield behind quarterback Trevor Andrews, second down and six from the 17 yard line. Into the line, that's Matt Butts. And he has the ball inside the 10 yard line and the Panther fans, Bob, have come alive. And with good reason, from the 17 down to the eight, a nice nine yard carry for Bunch. Again, doing this without Newcomer. Got ourselves a ball game here. First and goal from the eight. Trevor Andrews got to have something to do with this if they're going to get in the end zone. The pitch to Nate Andrews, hops across the five. Dropped at about the four yard line. Panther pride alive at the dome. Well, Ron Conley's got to be sitting back here, Craig, saying we really haven't done anything since the 9 22 mark of the second quarter. As we get close to the end of the third quarter, that's a pretty good effort. That's almost two quarters of action that Northwood has played them even. And now the Panthers, just like an arm wrestling match, is starting to go the other way. Yeah, they are. That you can feel the change of momentum. Trevor Andrews going to be stuck. A flag on the play. It might be a face mask. Two flags came and usually that doesn't mean holding. Usually that means some type of penalty. And it is going to be face mask. It'll be first down and goal to go at the one yard line. There's the call. I guess that's not really a bad penalty. He was at the one anyway, and if he's either going to do that or get in the end zone, Greg, you might as well go ahead and get a hold of his face mask. Andrews turns it in right here. Good read. Momentum going the other way, and 72 says, wait a minute. 
Nah, you might, uh, you're not gonna get in. That's six foot four, 240 pound Jason Simmons. When he's got, a, got your face mask, let him have it. 2.33 remains in the third quarter of play from the Hoosier Dome. You're watching the 3A state final. The Northwood Panthers and Ron Colley, the Rebels. First and goal, Matt Bunch. The yeah. bunch, the bunch, it goes to Andrews, and Trevor has the touchdown. Northwood scores for the first time. They're what back a, in it. What a great fake. Allie he has fooled. Had me fooled big time. Look at the nice the thing you liked was that Bunch was in the end zone. <laughs> Bunch would have scored too. So what a great drive. 61 yards on the drive for Northwood. Eight plays. And four first downs along the way. That uh, penalty, by the way, amounted to a half yard. Don't be surprised they go for two here. No good. No good. The point after no good as Croy misses on the point after attempt. Well, the touchdown counts with 2.19 to go in the third quarter. Watch Trevor Andrews. Good block out front there. And the touchdown makes it 14-6. Extra point missed. They're going to have to go for two eventually tonight anyway, and they will next time they score. Hopefully they'll have that opportunity. Remember, in Indiana high school football, you play it off. If the score is even at the end of regulation, they, each team gets the ball at the 10-yard line, and you go till somebody doesn't score, or you score more than the other team. And right now, Northwood Panthers, well, they had a pulse at halftime. They got a pretty good rhythm going right now. I like the opportunity they have, especially with their defense fired up. JN Stone Incorporated is a proud sponsor of Northwood High School football and wants to congratulate the Panthers on their accomplishments this season. JN Stone, for the beauty of natural stone at an affordable cost, call on the experts at JN Stone. Joe Spitznagel on the return, dropped at the 20 yard line. They're going to place it at about the 21. And that is where Ron Colley will set up here. From manufacturing to installation on any wall or surface, architectural stone is great either inside or out. So for residential or commercial installations, call on JN Stone at 905 East Waterford and Wakarusa, the number 862-4116. 862-4116. N Stone Incorporated, a proud sponsor of Northwood High School football. Brent Carver, the quarterback for Ron Colley on first down and 10 from the 21-yard line. Bone tripped up. Still on his feet. Oh, man, you just got get some wow, rope. Reinhardt and company. The Black Crunch finally putting the hammer down on Mike Bone. Somebody get a length of rope. You just, you just got to tie him up. I'm telling you what. Those uh, two yards don't come very easy here, do they? Mm, he's like a yeah. nan at a picnic. He's just going for some more. Some more. Some more. There you go. Yeah, about eight guys. Going to boil down to the Panther defense. I believe here in the second half, that's where it's going to come down to. Second down and seven now. Quite an adjustment on Bone. Bone with a big first quarter. Northwood trying to hold him, and there they come up with another big play defensively. Down to the 25, 26 yard line. Putting some licks on him. Third down, Bobby. Chad Hochstetler put a hit on him. Gain of a couple of yards on the play. 216 yards and 30 carries for Bone tonight. But Hochstetler put a good good time lick on him there. Third down and five. And believe me, if Northwood can stop him right here, momentum's got the full black uniform on. Big play coming up. Time running out in the third quarter. 30 seconds in county. Ron Colley on the move. And a nice play defensively. Credit the tackle there to 58 Corey Yoder, who we saw earlier in the ball game on the sideline with the ice pack on his leg. Yoder back in. 
And you see the left knee tape wrapped as he limps off the field. A big play here by Mr. Yoder. And he's going to be hurt tomorrow. Right now he's got a football game to play. What a courageous effort. And that's the end of the third quarter. Northwood has played their way back into it. We have one quarter to go in the Class 3A state championship. Indianapolis run County 14, Northwood 6. Back with the fourth quarter after this.